Hey, hey, hey. Welcome to Judy's Place. Y'all, we will be cooking three turkey wings. Now, I've got the flats here, and I've disconnected them from the um, drum. I'm going to tell you what kind of seasoning I'm using. I use two tablespoons of minced garlic, two tablespoons of adobo with comp seasonings, one tablespoon of garlic powder, one tablespoon of garlic of, of onion powder, forgive me, one tablespoon of ground black pepper, tablespoon of paprika. You can use the smoked or the regular. Ground thyme, about a teaspoon. And one teaspoon of chicken flavored bouillon. I'm going to stir it up in here real good. I'm going to add a little olive oil to make a paste. I'm going to start off with two tablespoons or more. Just want to make a little paste. Okay, I'm going to need two more tablespoons. Now I'm going to pat them on the flaps, pat the seasoning. And I'm going to bring the drums over here too. I just want to do the uh, flats first. And I'm going to do the flats the exact same way. And I'll be back. And next I'm going to drop the wings in the cooking oil. Part cooking oil and part, um, uh, what do you call it, uh, bacon grease. And listen, y'all, I found some bacon grease. It's about to grocery store. I'm going to show it to you. It's called Bacon Up. And I was surprised when I found it in uh, Walmart because I have never seen bacon sold out of the uh, grocery store. Now, lard, yes. Uh, cooking oil, yes. Um, now they're using coconut oil. Coconut grease or coconut oil. But I found this bacon up in Walmart and I said I was going to try to use it. I'm going to fry these turkey wings for about maybe 10 minutes. And I got them on medium. Let me look at it. I got them on medium. And uh, I'm going to do it for 10, 10, 15 minutes on medium, okay? I'll be right back. After seven minutes on one side, we flip them over and let them cook for seven minutes on the next side. We're going to do the uh, drum like that too. And you're trying to get this char texture right there. So, seven and seven, 15, we get these... Uh, Cook for 15 minutes. I'll be back. Okay, next time, next, next time. Next, we're gonna add the onions to the bottom. Now you can add them on top of your turkey wings, but I prefer to add them on the bottom so I can lay my turkey wings on top. I'm gonna take half of this first time 
and put it on the bottom. I'm taking each habanero pepper and putting it on the side. And that's it. That's all the fish. Oh, wait a minute. I forgot. Bay leaves. Add your bay leaves in, and I'll be right back. Okay, if you have any marinade or seasoning left, just drop it around the sides of the bowl. It, it won't do nothing but sink down to the vegetables, okay? And I made a barbecue sauce with some stuff I had in the refrigerator. <coughs> Excuse me. I have a lot of little empty bottles like this. The sweet chili sauce the sweet and spicy sauce, and they're empty now, okay? So I put like a third cup of each of those in. I put two cups of tomato ketchup, and um, about a tablespoon of butter in the, let me pick it up, in the sauce. We're gonna brush a little bit on top and all it's going to do is just sink down to the bottom of the vegetables and the uh wingets I mean, not wingets they are wingets isn't it because these are drums just brush a little on and we're going to bake them in the oven and it's going to be a good little while because i want them to come apart from the bone we're gonna bake them in the oven for about, I'm gonna, uh, let's see, I would say 300. And uh, I want them to stay in the oven for about maybe three hours. Okay, and we're gonna bake them about three hours. Three hours. Well, anyway, I'll let you know, okay? Okay, friends, I am so glad that I timed this this time because normally I don't time my food. I just walk in there and open up the oven and poke around in it. I am so glad that that I uh, timed it because uh, look at those uh, chicken uh, or turkey wings falling apart. I baked these for one hour. Now I'm getting ready to put the sauce on because I put them in at 12 and it's one now. So I'm gonna add the sauce on and this is at night. This is my dinner for tomorrow. Yeah, I'm gonna stick these back in and let it get coated on those uh, turkey wings. Because if I hadn't timed it, and I told y'all three, three, um, on 300, three hours. I'm glad I did not, uh, I came back and told y'all the right time. Okay, I'm gonna put the rest of this little sage on the top. I'm gonna stick it back in the oven until it glazes up. Okay, I said I knew I was gonna eat these tomorrow. I had to turn my oven off. But uh, at least I got one I can share with you guys. These turned out perfect. I mean, they, are, they, they fall off the bone, like I say. And I want to taste the barbecue sauce that I made up. Mm, mm, mm. That's good. Oh, I'm sorry. Here, here's y'all a piece. And I got to wing it. I like it with the fat on it. This is good. Mm-mm. I want them to fall off the bone, but I don't want them to fall off the bone. 
and like a little pool. Just a little pool. Mmm. And it's got the right flavor. The habaneros didn't bust in the turkey wings, so it didn't make them too hot. It just gave them a good flavor. I'm going to go, y'all. Be blessed. Stay humble. Mm, mm, mm. Have a good day. Mm-mm-mm. Bye for now, y'all.